But we begin tonight with a tragic update in the search for three men in Detroit. Thank you for being with us today at five. I'm Glenda Lewis and I'm Brian Abel. Michigan State Police confirming Armani Kelly, Montoya Givens and Dante Wicker were all found dead in the basement of an abandoned apartment building in Highland Park. It all began January 21st when the three men vanished after a show two of the men were slated to perform in was canceled. Armani Kelly reported missing January 22nd by his mom and Givens and Wickers were reported missing January 27th. Thursday, their bodies were found in the basement of an abandoned apartment complex in Highland Park. That apartment complex near Palmer Park, 12 miles away from where that show was expected to take place on Detroit's east side. And the complex is where 7 Action News reporter Whitney Burney joins us live tonight. And Whitney, you spoke with the family of Montoya Givens for the first time today. Yeah, Glenda, that's right. We are standing right in front of the apartment complex where police made that discovery last night. Families who are involved in this investigation, the victim's family, say it's been a challenging few weeks and they've been in the dark for most of it. While holding his mother's hand. Wake up every day and not know. To wake up, go to sleep every night, tell my kids, oh, we don't know. Philip Givens is looking for answers following the disappearance of his older brother Montoya. To be honest, it's just like any uh, any family, really. We just got to take it one day at a time. The 31 year old, one of the three men missing since January 21st. His mother says the last day she saw her son, he was planning to support a friend who was set to perform at Lounge 31. It's been radio silence ever since. There's no way he would not call me. There's no way. And that's why part of me feel like he is gone, but I don't know if nobody's is theirs. Thursday, police announced the discovery of three bodies in an apartment building in Highland Park, believed to be that of Dante Wicker, Armani Kelly, and Montoya Givens. Although MSP said conditions of the bodies and weather originally prevented them from identifying the remains, this afternoon the department said they were able to confirm the victims as Wicker, Kelly, and Givens. Givens' family says he was identified via fingerprints. Just hours prior, they'd held out the smallest bit of hope that this wouldn't be the end. I'm hoping to God that it's not him, and I feel bad for who parent it is, but I, really can't but I don't it's want it to be my thing. child. Now, one point during this investigation, police told us that a 15 year old had been brought in for questioning, but that team has since been released coming up tonight at six. We'll tell you exactly where the investigation stands. Live here in Highland Park, Whitney Burney, 7 Action News. Really a hurtful end to this one, Whitney. Thank you for the update.